Well, guys, welcome back. We are continuing from where we left off. We have been told to take the relics to some tree so that we could help Taro move on. Now, this is what we've seen down here. This is where we couldn't come up, but now we will be able to come up because this has opened. And I did find a, I did find a pine cone hat in this chest, by the way. Because uh, after I, we ended last episode, I quickly explored this so I don't have to waste time. And then we can just get back into the story. But that is all that was up there. Nothing more, nothing less. So I remember this, but this is where we wanted to go up and then we realized we cannot come up here. And that plant has disappeared, which is weird because I thought there was a blue plant here, but anyways. Now we need to go to a tree. And I think that's like the dead tree, yeah. So it might even be a cave. So I might have been right when I saw it as a cave. So let us um, go there. It's nice that the combat is so plentiful. I, I like that. Oh yeah, by the way, I did see something in my video that I was editing. There's a little owl statue here on this like glyph of some sort. Now, I don't know if we have to destroy the owl statue. See, if I stand here, there's this thing. I don't know what it's for. And it makes a humming as well. So, um... Have to shoot the, the statue. Have to shoot that. Oh, something happened. Well, that's what it is. I didn't get anything out of it. Don't really understand what the point of it is. Oh, well. But I did notice that. It looks like it's nothing. Nothing that important. And we have to go this way, I think. Pretty sure we're not missing anything big, maybe like a hat or two. But I might actually come back here and explore this area in my free time. We can actually just tor portal to this place right here. So yeah, so I thought we can enter this this hole over there when I when we first came this way. But maybe we can after all. to fight a version of him, like an evil version of Taro now? Oh no, he's alive. I thought he died. Well, if he didn't die, now he sure will. So this, this is like a big boss. This is a big boss. Oh, come on. I can't hit him. Holy fuck. Well, 
this is gonna be a charged attack. Yep. Okay, we do a one more hit on him. And then we can make a big hit on him. Somehow missed, unfortunately. Where is he? Oh, I thought I can get away from that. It looks like he's missing me too, like I am missing him. Timed that really bad. What the hell, I can't. I mean, I'm missing his, oh, I'm missing all my shots on this guy. He lost his sword from the looks of it. Oh, that's really bad. Oh, I died. Fuck. I thought I can parry that. Oh, God damn it. Try this again. What the fuck? Should have hit him. I didn't hit him. <sighs> oh, fuck. He's really fucking pissed. I am too. We're so close. Oh, no. Fuck, we did. Damn it. Ah, oh, I'm dead. Fuck, I thought I dodged that in time. Stupid. Fuck. Ah, oh, fuck, I didn't see him behind me already. And I'm fucking dodging all over the fucking shit here. I, I, I hit the lantern. I, I, I hit the fucking lantern. Why, why is it not working? Oh, are you kidding me? How many? What is this? What are we doing? Are you seriously fucking kidding me? I hit the lantern and it's not turning on. That was the closest we've got because if I would have hit the lantern, I even had an alt to use on it. Anyways, round 50 and so far we're doing well. We have not got hit and we have dealt somewhat of a damage to him. We're gonna bone to death. No, 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 you don't. Don't even try. We got this, guys. Hopefully. They are bonies to charge. Now, now there was no lantern, and, and now we hit a lantern. How the hell does that work? Oh, he hit me three times? Alright, I just gotta be quick and don't dodge it. Okay, headshots don't really count, but they do damage, so I'm just gonna be shooting him whenever I can. But goal is to hit the lantern. We are doing good so far. Still doing good. Got away from him. Too slow. But we survived. And we don't even need to heal yet. Oh, I thought we dodged that. Now we need to heal. There's a little blue healy plant. Let's just use it. Perfect. Oh. I don't know if you guys see it, but he likes to like move to the side right before he lands on, the, on one of these jumps. It's like uh, really hard to predict. No, no, no. What I, I didn't want to do that. It's hard to track him when he's moving like that because the rotation with controller is slower and, and, and there's no way of putting it up, I already checked. Is he stuck? Now I don't want to go too close to him, but I, I think he's stuck. Got a feeling if I go there, he'll one hit kill me. Oh, never mind, he's already out. Oh, now I gotta dodge this. Perfect. I can get his lantern one more time. And we can get him. If he doesn't pick us up, where is he? Oh fuck! Oh, we still have. We still have enough health. We have to hit his lantern now. Can hard to hit it. Okay. There we go. Finally! Holy fuck! That, this one was tough. I hope he dies. I hope he dies. 
Actually, I, I don't hope he dies because we need we need Taro alive, but still. God damn, that was tough. Am I supposed to shoot him? Oh, okay. Timing the combos are is hard because to, to use the special ability, I have to charge up a heavy attack and then press X. It says down there, uh, Rod Hammer press X. However, when I want to run and do a heavy attack, then it also does this, right? So when you're trying to move around and you want to charge one, you have to make sure you're not running anymore so that you have time to charge. And the bow too, you have to hold it and you shoot with the same button that you do a heavy attack with. So sometimes I'm shooting with the bow instead of doing a heavy attack and making all these mistakes. I don't know how much of that you guys understand because you don't play on a controller and if you do, you might, but holy shit. So I think he's dead. I think that's why he was a spirit. The sickness that took our parents was spreading through the village. Spirits of the forest, walk with our people. Guide them on their journey to the mountain shrine. Food was running low. Everyone was scared. I never felt so helpless. Saya wanted to stay. But I thought we could go to Rusu for help. I was sure he would know what to do. But something was not right in the woods. I had never seen Rusu so worried. He sent us back to the village. And I knew we were alone. I was all that Benny and Saya had left. I had to protect them. In the next morning.
their older brother. I was supposed to protect them. Even now, it's hard to forgive myself. Taro, the children know how much you care for them. What happened in the village wasn't your fault. You will always be their older brother, and they still need you. It's okay. You have to go now. 